I used to think that every output needed a high pass filter because speakers need protection and why would I want any unnecessary low frequencies making a mess? So I would put a high pass filter on the output of my console and on my speaker processor and anywhere else that I could find. And I would always use, you know, a Linkwitz Riley fourth order filter because everyone knows those are the best filters. And it didn't sound great. And I didn't know why. And at the time, I don't think I understood that I was, you know, doubling and even tripling down on filters, causing unnecessary phase shift and misalignment. And that's why I'm really excited about my new workshop, because I'm finally getting to take a deep dive into crossover filters and all pass filters in a way that I haven't before in my other videos, articles and courses. So we're going to be looking at how all of that stuff fits together to not only help you make better alignments and fix common problems like, you know, combining speakers from different manufacturers, but also introduce some beam steering into our designs and fun stuff like that. Okay, so an intro to the phase graph, we got started with validating our data, reading the graph and comparing relative phase relationships. In Phase Alignment Science Academy, we're gonna cover the fundamentals of some of the most common filters in our toolbox and look at some practical questions like microphone placement. So a few months ago, I published this 36 page guide to microphone placement for subwoofer alignment. And it's long and it's really interesting, but in this workshop, we don't have time for all that, right? So I'm going to attempt to simplify that entire document that entire process into about two major categories that I think should work for most of the designs that you'll run into. So if you haven't taken that intro course already, I, I really recommend that you do. I think it'll help a lot, especially before going into this second workshop. And as an incentive, uh, there's a discount code in that workshop. So you'll sign up for the intro course and then on the course page there's a discount code for twenty dollars off this next workshop i am truly looking forward to sharing this stuff with you so if this topic of phase alignment is something that you've been wanting to learn more about i hope that you'll join me thanks <laughs>